This is a moment Ryan Nickel wasn't sure would happen so soon. At this time last year, I could wiggle a toe, basically. A farm accident left Nickel with serious spinal cord injuries last fall. He's been in a wheelchair full time until a few months ago when he began using this wearable robot. The exoskeleton helps people like Nickel gain the strength to stand up, take steps, even raise a leg. You do take it for granted until you actually have to train your body and mind to do it all over again that you don't realize how hard it actually is to walk. Since arriving to the Glen Rose Hospital three years ago, the exoskeleton has helped more than 80 people learn to walk. I think it's definitely life changing to get people up as early as possible. It's really helpful and it really helps um, decrease the amount of assistance they would need in the long term. It's now being used on younger patients like 16 year old Hussein Al Hussani. Wearing this was an easy sell. They just said, oh, it's kind of like a robot, like a Iron Man kind of suit. So I'm like, okay. Al Hussani was born with cerebral palsy. He uses the device to help strengthen his posture and improve balance. What does it feel like when it's on you? Like I'm um, powerful, <laughs> like no one can get past me. Just, yeah, like that. And the EXO helps my disability not get in the way. The hope is ongoing treatments with the EXO will soon make him strong enough to do simple things he's always dreamed of. Probably start kicking a ball. Chanel Call, CTV News, Edmonton.